Next stop on Aung San Suu Kyi's European tour, Norway, where she'll accept her Nobel Peace Prize on Saturday, two decades after it was awarded. The Nobel Committee's chairman will introduce her and tell why she got the prize in 1991. There will be music, of course, and then she'll give her Nobel speech. So the only thing which will not happen is actually that she is the Peace Prize is handed over to her because she actually got it before. In Norway, the pro-democracy activist weekend will be packed with meetings, dinners and official appearances something that might be scaled back considering she fell ill during a press conference on Thursday in Switzerland and then had to cancel on an official dinner that evening. During her 17-day tour of Europe, the Nobel Peace Prize winner is hoping to show that Burma has changed and to encourage international investment in the country. I would like to call for aid and investment that will strengthen the democratization process by promoting social and economic progress. Burma's autocratic government has launched a series of reforms in recent years, releasing political prisoners, including Suu Kyi herself, and opening up the country to the international community. Many Western governments have eased or lifted sanctions in response. Suu Kyi's European trip is seen as further sign of progress.